Amen. Bless the Lord. Today I'm coming from John the seventh chapter and the fourteenth verse. It says, Now about the about the midst of the feast, Jesus went up in the temple and taught. And the Jews marveled, saying, How knoweth this man letters, having never learned? Jesus answered them and said, My doctrine is not mine, but is his that sent me. If any man would do his will, he shall know of the doctrine, whether it be of God or whether I speak of myself. He that speaketh of himself seeketh his own glory, but he that seeketh his glory that sent him, the same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. Did not Moses give you the law? And yet none of you keepeth the law. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. And he says here, glory be to God. This that speaketh, amen, glory be to God, according to the, the word of God, amen, is speaking as they are led by God. He says, Jesus answered them and said, my doctrine is not, uh, it's not mine, but is his that sent me. And as I was looking at this, you know, I just want to encourage you, amen, that's out there listening to me by way of YouTube, make your calling an election sure. If God's called you, amen, if God's called you to ministry, if God's called you, hallelujah, he will, praise be to God, put his stamp of approval upon you. The Bible tells us to study to show thy self-approval and work when need not to be ashamed, but rightly divide the word of truth. A lot of people Praise God has not been called. They just went or they was just sent, but God did not call them. A lot of people have book knowledge. They went to theology, hey, school, and they've learned, praise God, hallelujah, according to the letter, praise be to God, but God has not called them. And I want to let you know, you don't have to go to theology school, amen, to be a preacher, amen, to be a minister, amen, hallelujah, glory be to God, to be a pastor. Yes, it's good to enhance your learning. It's good to study, amen, to know Amen. The word of God. But at the end of the day, God is the one that calls us. Hallelujah. So many, praise God. Hallelujah. So many appointed is in the anointed place where God has anointed you for that position. God has anointed, hallelujah, and put that call upon your life. But I just want to encourage you and let you know that God is the one. Blessed be the name of the Lord. God is the one that called you. You see here that Jesus was in the temple and he was teaching. Glory be to God because the word of God was on the inside of him. And they were saying, how can he know these things? How can he teach these things when he's never been learned, when he's never went to school for that? Praise be to God because the word of God was on the inside of him. Hallelujah. And the Bible lets us know that the Holy Ghost will bring all things to your, to your knowledge. Amen. But you have to put something in. Glory be to God. Yes, you does. Hallelujah. You have to study. You have to, hallelujah, study the word of God. But the Holy Ghost will bring it out. And it's one thing, praise God, to know the word of God and not have the anointing. Amen. But it's the anointing that destroys the yoke. So we need to get, hallelujah, in our calling, praise God. Abide. Amen. In the calling that the Lord has called you and for the edification of God, not of yourself. So many people, amen, go to all these biblical biblical schools and learn all this doctrine and have MD behind their name and this behind their name. But there is no Praise God, anointing behind it. And a lot of them, hallelujah, glory be to God, is doing it for self-gain. And to for men to look and say, this is Dr. So-and-so, and this is Reverend So-and-so, and this is Bishop So-and-so, and Apostle this and Apostle that. But it's not for you to be glorified. It's not for us to be glorified, but it's for God to get the glory. God has anointed some, praise God. God has appointed some. Man has appointed some, hallelujah, but we got to be anointed and appointed by God, hallelujah, so that God can get the glory, hallelujah, and God can be edified in our life. Blessed be the name of the Lord. When you get up before people, praise God, hallelujah, don't let it be about your your own knowledge, your own wisdom, what you have obtained through book knowledge, but let it be the leading of the Holy Ghost, the anointing of the, 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 anointing of the Lord Jesus Christ. Walk in your calling. Walk in it, hallelujah, according to the word of God. I love you, may heaven forever smile upon you is my prayer. Glory be to God.